selfish. Don't live to make a good impression on others. Be humble. Thinking of others as better than yourself. You see, pride wrecks relationship. Pride walks by people with needs. And number three, pride is the roadblock to happiness. Now think about this. Everybody wants to be happy. How many of you want to be happy? Yeah. I went on to Amazon last night, and I put in the search, books on happiness. And it came up with 13,015 books <laughs> on happiness. Everybody wants to be happy. One of the books was, Love Yourself Like Your Life Depends On It. Another one was, The Joy of Retirement, Finding Happiness, Freedom, and the Life You've Always Wanted. One of them was 99 Ways to Be Happier Every Day. There's even a book called The Basset Hound, An Owner's Guide to Happy, Healthy Pet. And that's quite a book because I have never met a basset hound that was happy. <laughs> and then I wake up this morning and I get an email from Books A Million. I, I'm a member of the Books A Million Club and I do love to read books. And they send me these emails of books that are featured that I've got to have. If I'm really a smart person that likes to read. And you know what the book was that I clicked on? It says, you are a bad bleep. How to stop doubting your greatness and start living an awesome life. That was the book that they're recommending, the book of the month. Listen, there's so much advice on how to be happy. Why is it that more people aren't happy? Because... Thinking about yourself and serving yourself is not the pathway to happiness, folks. Amen. The way to happiness is humility and service. Notice in Matthew 5, 3, Sermon on the Mount, the first beatitude, Jesus said, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Now look at that word blessed. The word blessed literally means happy. Happy are the poor in spirit. Who are the poor in spirit? Jesus is referring to those who are humbly acknowledging that they have a debt that they cannot pay without Christ. This is not talking about blessed are those who are down in the dumps. Blessed are the poor in spirit. Blessed is the person that recognizes that apart from Christ, they are not good enough spiritually to enter into God's plans and purposes for their lives. 